It was three days of violence that engulfed India's most populous city and gripped the attention of the world. Only recently released to the public, this security camera vision shows the horrifying reality of just one chapter of the Mumbai attacks. 31 of the 166 victims died here at the luxury Taj Mahal Hotel. The video shows gunmen going room to room, kicking in doors looking for hostages, while also discussing how to light the fires that raged while the world's media watched from outside. The Mumbai attacks began around sunset on November 26th when 10 gunmen landed in inflatable boats. It took little more than an hour for them to fan across the city, plunging it into chaos. Their targets included a Jewish outreach centre at Nariman House, popular tourist spot Leopold's Cafe, the luxury hotels, the Taj Mahal and the Oberoi Trident across the peninsula, the Karma Hospital and the Chhatrapati Shivaji railway station. Armed with automatic rifles and grenades, the gunmen fired indiscriminately along the way, setting off bombs and holding hostages for up to 60 hours. Commandos smoked out the last gunman on November 28th, freeing some of the hostages while others died in the final gun battle. The incident frayed already tense ties between nuclear-armed neighbours India and Pakistan. Pakistan has acknowledged that the Mumbai attacks were plotted and partly launched from its soil and has put seven suspects on trial. Ajmal Kassab is the only gunman to have been captured alive. Charged with waging war against India, his trial is underway in Mumbai and could end in a death sentence. While Indians await the result, many still question how such a shocking and large-scale attack could have ever been allowed to happen in the first place. Dan Nolan, Al Jazeera.